What's going on everybody? Pop Principal here with another Funko Pop review and we have Kang from Quantum Mania. Um now this is the first iteration of Kang we will get in his powerful form. We've seen him in what was it? Loki season 1 as he who remains and he really wasn't uh at his full power or anything of the sort he was more just a timekeeper at that at that stage so in quantum mania will be our first experience with the real full powered king and the movie is not out at the moment so i'm not a hundred hundred percent sure on all of the details and how he will be portrayed but through the trailers and everything we've seen so far um that's pretty much what it's been um super excited about this movie it is about a month a month away a little less than a month away we're still in january it comes out mid-february so super excited uh loved everything i've seen so far in the trailers um looks like it's going to be a much more serious much more high stakes movie and the other two i i definitely appreciated the first ant-man was probably my favorite and the second was cool um i thought it leaned into the silliness just a little bit too much but that's okay uh some people like this some people don't and from everything we've seen so far this movie will be a lot more serious and they've they're saying kang is even more powerful than thanos so it'll be interesting to see how this particular character plays out and shout out to jonathan majors who's been killing it for a long time and i'm glad he's getting his just due on the biggest stage possible so and i love this he who remains character so i can only imagine what he's going to do with kang um but let's get right into an outer box look at kang here we have kang outer box and he's in his traditional green and purple colorway um looks pretty good he you see this green cape primarily green cape with the purple highlights i'm curious what exactly his suit does and what kind of power he will actually show us in the mcu so um i appreciate it not looking as goofy as well not as goofy but the, i feel like the comic book version of kang probably might not have translated as well as the suit that they actually finalized so very happy with this suit but it like i said it has this uh majority green and purple highlights as you can see the armor looks good um no real splotches no real uh paint mess ups or anything like that uh you see the lines down his those, those quintessential king lines down his eyes i'm not sure if they're scars or what they are hopefully they give us the background of what exactly they are um hair texture looks great the paint application on the hair is good no real spillover on the actual skin and ears and face so i appreciate this pop um definitely excited about this movie and super excited about what kang is actually going to bring to the mcu um yeah so uh let's get into a comparison video and of course i brought together kang and he who remains because i feel like that's the best uh comparison i have at the moment um both pretty much the same character just different variants and i think we're going to get a few more variants from all the rumors and things that i've read about kang so this is a very dope looking pop um love the armor they nailed it um couldn't complain about anything so far as far as the aesthetic and it looks pretty different uh, 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 from the he who remains pop which um as we should expect i wonder what other variants and what kind of uh, other suits we will get because i know he's he's going to be around for a while i know he's not going to get defeated in the first movie he's in so um it'll be interesting to see it will definitely be interesting to see so like subscribe keep watching um as i get all my ant-man pops um together so i hope you guys appreciate this video